guys following me to the market so I can my sister this is me driving on the highway yeah I'll just stick here around to see my environment I stay in Lagos Nigeria on the highland so the first thing I did I branched in a local restaurant to eat mala our local food here amala and cat's fish so my sister went to bring some you know drink some drinks to set stuff it down yeah that's which you make chocolate that's not the way i'm looking because i've been stressing myself lately but i've been engaged in a lot of physical activities that has trained us let me just eat before we enter the market. You can see my food. I finished everything. Look at the bone. I was merciless. <laughs> yeah, let's get it down with Fanta. The chocolate drink is for my sister. So we go to the bank. I will draw I will do some change. I'll be needing my market shopping this is my sister we get to one of the market it was so sunny and the sun was really really scorching like the sun was so hot mind the way we look because we've been stressed so this is called Surya market in Lagos Island so we got five dollar of dried fish from this woman and we got five dollars worth of catfish from her sister has been very really supportive yeah just showing you our vicinity and my sister was always ahead of me she's so tired we had to share this umbrella yeah, we needed to buy up flour here, yam, to make yam flour, but we didn't see a very good one. I got a do what we um called jute eggs in English. I got it for like fifty cents. That's five hundred dollars, fifty cents. And all these papers are worth four dollars. So we went inside them that, that guy here is Brendan pepper we wanted to buy yam here but we didn't let her buy it i bumped into this young baby and he fell down so i had to just let him and calm him down so um here we got a yam flower from this old woman she was begging me to buy more from her but i couldn't get more um i just got what i needed she was begging me to buy more i think she she hasn't made sales throughout the day i pitied the whole room and uh, i just got what i needed then yeah i was actually looking at her here i think she hasn't made any sales but she was happy that i got a young flower from her even though she wanted me to buy more I, just, I got what I needed and he gave us then we left so we are heading back to another side of the market and that is sun the secondary school students are closed for the day so I decided to just take a video of them different schools in the area we are going home after school hours they close by 2 p.m here in nigeria and my sister <laughs> my lovely sister my supportive sister okay so yeah just showing you a, around this is a short market vlog then we stopped here to buy meat this is good meat goat's meat so i got a leg i got it for nine dollars 
it could be length of nine dollars i asked this man if i can record him because i'm doing a short vlog um and he said no problem no mind just flies and that is why we wash our meats well before we cook them these are fresh goat meat i've been eating cow meat i just decided to buy some goat meat um these are the internal organs that's my favorite internal organ so the school students are buying chicken legs here yeah, chicken feet and potatoes as we were heading back to another side of the market yeah we got a cotton here i just had to tell my sister to sit down because it was really really she was stressed even me i look i i look, I look homeless i'm so tired i was so tired so here we got yam two two bags of yam for five dollars here and one paint of onions for five dollars Pepe five dollars. It could be another five dollars from so I went back to grab lunch because we were so tired and hungry. Okay, I'll tell you a short story about this man. I was really really impressed with what he did here. This this man now I bought something from him and I think I, I I was supposed to give him fourteen five and I gave him fifteen thousand there. So he came back, he, he looked for me, and he returned five hundred naira out of the money I gave him. So I've actually promised him that I'll come again and again to patronize him. Ah, uh -huh. see, there are still good people in Nigeria. You see, I was surprised at what the man did there hmm. because not in Nigeria they will return your money never. So we got to another side to buy the palm slippers and this is how the market looks like. So I got here to buy a fluffy rug cape hat. I need it. So I needed it and I got one. On the other side my sister got her own umbrella because of the sun. The sun can fry you like it, it was so hot. Then I got a true pillow, one dollar each, the equivalent of one dollar each. And the fluffy rug I got was around seven dollars, the equivalent of seven dollars each. And what else? Where did, we, where did we go to from here? Okay, I'll just show you how the site looks like. Yeah, we got here. I just got a flower, the equivalent of five dollars each for interior decor. Yeah, I just want my room to look able to be fine, finer. See, everybody are selling. I'm doing Christmas sales. Can you see those lights? Christmas decoration. Look at this. Like he was showing me that he has iPhone because he saw me recording with my iPhone. I don't know why he did that. He's trying to impress me, but I'm not impressed with the phone. Never. So, yeah, I decided to record us again. We were so stressed. Well. We left home nine in the morning. We came back ten p.m. at night. It was a whole day. Yeah, something happened here. They were fighting, and they nearly killed each other with a knife. I stopped recording so they won't snatch my phone. And here we were heading back home it was night already I don't really like driving late at night but I just had to I had to because I don't even want to take any commercial bus with the stuffs I bought from the market it will be so stressful look at this beauty here this is the heart of Lagos State Victoria Highland and this is where at least 95% of all banks headquarters are situated here in Victoria Highland. I see this decoration was made by Zenit Bank and trust me they spent they spent millions of naira 
on these decorations like this decoration is really beautiful and that is the way they do every festive period in nigeria just take a look at this beauty so i just decided to record it i decided to record it like they spent a lot of money on decoration on the street this is Victoria Highland. It was very close to a cool hotel and so I love coming to this side most every time. Anytime I'm going out. Let's take a look at this beauty. Do you feel that? Do you see that? I'm still coming back here with my sisters to take pictures on Christmas Day. There's a lot of people come here and take pictures Christmas. So this is one of the stress I've been through the past couple of weeks because I've been running errands for my family, getting them some stuff they need for Christmas because the stuffs are cheaper at the market we went to today. And Lagos and here there was traffic there was traffic here 